Well, hello, Aquarius. Thank you guys so much for coming. Hey, today is going to be a short video. This is just going to be gifts uh, for 2021, and we're just going to see what we have. I have had some amazing videos, and I'm telling you that I'm actually surprised, okay? <laughs> so we're going to see what's going on with you, Aquarius. This video is going to be very short. It's not going to be that long, but I want to put a smile on you guys' face today. So let's go ahead and get it. So Aquarius, 2021 gifts. For Aquarius. Okay. Gifts for Aquarius. Let's go. Let's do it. Oh, this two been coming out a lot. I'm not, I need to take only three. All right. So I'll do. I'll just do it like this. So I'm just gonna tell you what I'm seeing. So I definitely see that there's going to be justice, literally. Now remember, these are not the only cards I'm going to pull. I'm just going to go with the flow. You guys, I already know, have been going through hell this year, okay? Some of you guys, this is extended from two years ago. You guys have been going through so much. But there with the justice card, it is letting me know that that rejection you felt, this, um, this, this fighting, this fussing, the sneakiness that you guys have been going through with your person or people in your life, this is letting me know here with the justice card, this is going to be long gone. It's going to be out of the picture. This is something that you guys are not going to be dealing with anymore. Justice here means justice for you. That's exactly what it means. Here, no more mental conflict, none of that. Um, and again, I know uh, uh, like what you guys have been going through in the past. So don't look at this as, oh my God, I see the same thing. No, this is what you guys are going to have justice over. So we're talking about through courts, okay? This is talking about getting peace. That is exactly what this is talking about. Spirit has to go directly in on what you guys have been feeling and thinking. And it is justice for all of this rejection, pain, agony, and conflict. Okay. And this is balancing out. But I want to put this back just because I'm only supposed to get three. So let's go ahead and get some more cards here. We're going to get three cards for Aquarius. Three cards for Aquarius. There we go. Let's go ahead and see what we got. Here I have three of emotions. Ooh, this is talking about <laughs> wonderful news is on its way. Announcements regarding engagement, pregnancies, and also says new friends will be made. Communities of like-minded people drawing closer. It's talking about exciting new beginnings. I told you guys this. Sometimes you guys, yeah, I don't think you guys be believing me sometimes, Aquarius. Exciting new beginnings is just around the corner. Does it not say that? You guys see it? I always have to show you because you think I'm just telling you. Can you guys see that? Why is my camera not focusing? Oh, okay. So my camera is going to be acting crazy today. This is also talking about reuniting with people um, that, you know, this could be friends, family. Now, we're not talking about anyone that, that's been treating you this way. But some of Aquarius's are here because they want to know if someone is going to reunite. Someone who may have rejected you, your offers have made you feel rejected. Um, to me, I do see we'll be coming back into your life. Okay. That's only for some, that's only for some at this point, we're talking about new beginnings. Okay. But this is a general reading here. This is the eight of action. Okay. This is the eight of wands. It says there's so much going on right now that it may feel overwhelming to you. And yet it is wonderful to be so busy with work that you love. And it says express of gratitude. And, but here it says, um, uh, oh, Wait, it says, express gratitude for those blessings of heaven that will be coming upon. It says, in taking up your time, even if your life feels challenging. It says, if you've asked to travel and take a flight, then do so with confidence and in due time. So here it talks about there may be a lot going on, okay? But you're, you're moving in the right direction. Um, you may be feeling very overwhelmed, but everything is going to work out completely fine. I kind of butchered that a little bit because I couldn't see. <laughs> My eyes are bad a little bit. But again, we're talking about new beginnings here. Ooh, help, helper of emotion. Okay, I don't know why my camera is not focusing. That's kind of getting on my nerves. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's just weird. It's like it's not focusing. 
romance blooms and find yours and it says and you find yourself falling in love wow okay i did see this for you i've already told you aquarius i saw this happening for a lot of you gifts of flowers love letters and poems read aloud are all in your future it talks about weddings past life connections i had already said that something someone new is um it says someone new who is romantic dreamy emotional will enter your life this person may be an artist or someone who have an idea of love that matches yours. Now, this is not saying that it's going to be a sneaky person. This is just falling on there. But I believe that it's going to be a very strategic type of way that this person is going to come into your life. Okay. All right. Let's get some more here. Oh, my goodness. Aquarius, I told you. I think this is too. Some of you guys are going to try to sneak away. You're going to see it. And some of you guys are going to be a little afraid of it. <laughs> That's you guys being overthinking when it comes into your life that's what's going to happen here i have the king of cups okay it's it's love all the way in this reading yes it is safe to trust i just said it i knew this was you i knew it i knew that was you because see you guys have been through hell so you're not going to trust it here it's telling you to heal this is the four of swords insight that comes from quiet meditation the need to have more sleep um, and time off and relief from stress. I told you guys, this is talking about healing, you know, calming down. Remember, it was talking about a lot of things are happening, being overwhelmed. Cards are talking to each other and literally are all from the same, from different decks. Ooh. Here we have the Queen of Pentacles. It says, nurture yourself and those who love you. The ability to make anything more beautiful. It says, being practical and having wise advice. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is amazing. That is very abundant. That's the Queen of Pentacles, okay? Let's go ahead and get your last deck here. I want to get two cards out of this one. I didn't expect to see all this love in your read, Aquarius. I didn't, I didn't expect to see it, but it's here. Okay, you're talking about gifts from the universe in 2021. This is it. Let's go ahead and get it. This is, the, uh, this is the king of sword. It says, this is a time. At this time, it is very important that you communicate clearly, be objective and unemotional. Uh, unemotional. And it says, and act as a professional as possible. Because some of those, some things that you guys may be going through may be um, through courts and things of that nature. So just be careful and be very intellectual about the situation you're in. Be very strategic about, um, you know, removing yourself away from anything, dealing with this, any past per people that may be pulling on your energy. Okay. And I definitely see that and I feel like I knew that seven of swords was more so you getting away from any drama here this is the high priestess of course we know it says is it a time to pause and reflect it says not to take action trust in your intuition um, it says as nothing is hidden from your divine intuition or divine eyes basically so I definitely see that you guys are going to be very logical you're going to use your intuition you're going to find love and everything that you guys have been going through in the past the rejection is going to be out I love you, Aquarius. Happy holidays.